everybody, it's Tamara Henry with Real TV Films. We're here at the Tribeca Film Festival at the Buddha Bar. Have you guys been meditating? Yes. <laughs> There's like little Maybe fishes. After. There's still time. And you guys are with Killer Movie, and this is Tori DeVito, and this is Paul Wesley. Yes. It's so glad to be talking to you guys, and you're the lead actor, right? Yes, I am. That's an incredible uh, responsibility. Picture this, a small border town, the high school hockey team. For the first time in the school's history, they got a shot at the state championship. They need a solid director up there, and I told them you're the guy. I like it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. But it's not your first time to be a lead. You've done lots of other movies, right? Uh, actually, like, I've, I've done a bunch of movies, but I've actually really never been the lead of a movie. I've been the lead of, like, a TV series. Okay. So this is actually my first time being a lead in a film, which is, well, like a lead lead. Like, uh -huh. uh, you get your very own celebrity blanket champion. God bless her. She has got some beautiful tits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I'm sure she'll be uh, flattered. You think so? so it's actually, all of your all of your biggest biggest fans. Where do they know you the best from? Your TV uh, series? I don't have any biggest biggest fans <laughs> oh, actually. Yes, you do. Uh, my mom. well, my mom. Uh, <laughs> she knows me from. Oh right, she gave birth to me. Um, <laughs> No, I don't know. I mean, you know, I've done some like little, like you know, Everwood, and there's some teeny, yeah. teeny bopper shows right. I've done that I guess I could be known. So you've from, been on the cover of those magazines. Uh, no, like I that. haven't actually. Oh, okay. <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe one. I'm gonna do Lee. Three quarters of my crew is missing. And your character, what would you like love most about your being the lead? Uh, I, I think he was like the only one in the movie that was like a stable rock. He was he was the he was the one that like I took myself pretty seriously in the role, and I think everyone else was kind of fun and uh, almost like caricatures. And um, so he's kind of like the audience can relate to my character, mm -hmm. which is kind of cool. Which I think that's the responsibility of being sort of the lead in the movie. You know, the audience has to be able to relate to you. Um, so hopefully, I pulled that off. We'll All see. Right. I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> um, and that's it. I, I'm, I'm, I'm a reality TV show director who um, gets thrown in this, uh, directing this reality show in the middle of nowhere, and there's a killer on the loose. Oh my God! He's filming people while he kills them. Oh, tell us about your character in Killer Movie. Tell us about her. Um, I play the assistant to the producer of the reality TV show, and you know she's just a very fun character, very gullible, very walks around, you know, with a little clipboard, constantly following this girl in the back of her heels, and she's a really fun character to play. You know, she had her little catchphrase at the end of every scene, and right. just fun. Yeah, I just got off of One Tree Hill. I played the psycho nanny for about 10 episodes, so I was, I think, more hated than loved, but it was a fun job to do. I don't know, I did a TV series called Beautiful People for a while, which uh -huh. was really great. And, um, yeah. Just well, speaking of beautiful people, this film was chocked full of beautiful people, yeah. and the character you played had l much longer hair, is that right? Uh, yes. I Am I being punked? I thought they canceled the show. Ashton! Actually, um, on One Tree Hill, they actually cut off my hair in the last episode. Oh, they did? Yeah. That was part of, they wrote it into the script, huh? Uh, they you did, see yeah. see rocks falling on the floor. <laughs> yeah, well, I, when I go psycho, I kind of did a transformation. I stole the kid I was nannying and, you know, changed my hair so nobody would recognize me. It was very psycho-esque. It was nice. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So are you guys just totally stoked to be here at Tribeca, or have you done the festivals before? No, Is it no big this deal? this is your first time. This is your first festival? Yeah. So what are you thinking so far? It's, well, we, it's awesome. It's, <laughs> I, it's really cool. Yeah, it's a very prestigious festival, and, and I think when we first heard that the film got accepted, we were very, very taken aback and then very honored, and it's, we're really excited to be here. Are you looking forward to meeting Robert De Niro? I, I, if Robert De Niro shows up to the Killer Movie screening, <laughs> I think I could officially say that I've lived my life to the fullest. Right, you Robert can go home De Niro. now, right? Yeah, I, I highly doubt he'll be there, but if I, I, that'd be an amazing thing to meet yeah, Robert De Niro. He's one of my idols. I'd be a little second-guessing a lot of my performances. Yeah, <laughs> I'd yeah. be like, don't watch, don't watch this thing. <laughs> make an actor feel insecure. I think Robert De Niro right. has that power. But, yeah. Um, but that'd be cool. yeah. All right. Beware. Screecher movie. All right, it's a killer movie. It's, it's comedy. You're going to love it. And you heard it right here first at Real TV Films. Keep watching. Mm -hmm.